Good afternoon, everybody. I'm uh, Nathan Dinesh, and I'm super excited to introduce you to this year's Research in Applied AI Summit. I'll take a few moments before we kick, kick off with today's agenda to give you a sense of the purpose that we have with RISE, the community that we have with us today, the RISE Foundation that we set up a few years ago, a venture fund, Air Street Capital, and a little bit about today's event. So some of you know, RISE is a community of AI entrepreneurs, researchers, and operators. And we're all coming here because we're focused on the science and applications of AI technology. We started this community back in 2015. And back then we had some early movers in the AI space from big tech companies and startups, media, and academia. And over the years, we've grown quite significantly. So today's RISE community encompasses large publicly traded technology companies, businesses in all sorts of segments, as well as large startups that are on the list to go IPO, including your smaller two-person shop that's just started. We also have great coverage throughout the academic community, ranging from top-notch universities around the world and governmental institutions and healthcare services. And our membership is from all over the world. Just this year, we had applications from 51 countries. And we're really excited to take this opportunity to try and run an event throughout the whole day across a couple time zones connecting everybody today. As most of you know, our event is usually held in London, but we live in very special times. And while it's really challenging, we're very excited to try an online experiment, bringing everybody together in times when community is extremely valuable. Now the events organized by me, um, I'm GP of a fund called Air Street Capital and managing trustee of the RISE Foundation. And I'm helped by a fantastic team of volunteers coming from a range of universities and companies. And the common thread that runs amongst all organizers and speakers attendees is that we have this collective ambition to create positive impact using transformative technology that is machine learning and AI. Now, I just wanted to highlight a couple of the achievements of the many companies that we presented to you last year at RISE 2019 and what they've gone on to achieve in the last 12 months. So just a couple of days ago, <clears throat> Mapillary, which is a crowdsourced computer vision company that's mapping the world, was acquired by Facebook. And we featured Jan Eric, who's co-founder and CEO, just two years ago. Many congrats to him and his team. Last year, we featured Kunle Olukutan, who's a professor well-renowned from Stanford University, who co-founded a semiconductor company called Sambanova Systems, which has just recently joined the Unicorn Club, raising $250 million. We featured Aaron Kimball, who's CTO of an amazing company called Zymergen, based in Emeryville in California. And they recently released their new product, which is entirely designed through biology to bring into smartphones and electronics around the world. We featured James Field, who's CEO and founder of Lab Genius. And a couple months after he spoke, he announced a $10 million Series A to bring his protein engineering technology to market. And finally, we uh, also announced a partnership with uh, OpenMind and PyTorch, uh, which is sponsored by Facebook. Um, we facilitated a grant of $250,000 that's sponsoring fellowships around the world for people who contribute to privacy preserving machine learning in open source. So taken together, RISE is really about catalyzing new connections, career opportunities, and importantly, access to best practice. And as you see, we do this through community, like events um, such as the one today, our fellowships program, and also through startup capital. Now for community events, today is our flagship RISE uh, annual conference, but we also run six to eight meetups a year, now also online under the London AI brand. You also know that about 100% of the ticket revenues that we generate through this conference is going to support the RISE Foundation, which was set up two years ago to advance education and research in AI for the global common good. Because we believe that this powerful technology is going to be useful for far more than for-profit endeavors. So if you're interested in applying for grants or want to learn more and help us grow this initiative, please email us at info at rise.org or head to rise.org forward slash apply to share your idea. 
To give you a sense of the um, projects that we've supported over the years, I'll highlight two, namely the PyTorch OpenMind Fellowship that we facilitate through uh, OpenMind, where we're currently sponsoring 15 fellows to work on privacy preserving machine learning. And this is growing very fast. We also were first donors to Open Climate Fix, an organization that's using machine learning to try and slow climate change. On the startup capital front, uh, I'm GP of a fund called Airsuite Capital, which invests in AI-first technology and life science companies. And over the years, we've been privileged to be involved in a couple of amazing companies in both of these segments, some of whom have spoken at Rise before. And together with a fantastic team of operating partners from big tech companies and startups that have gone through successful uh, M&A transactions, we're looking to make more investments in the field and help the community as a firm that's really born from within it. So here are my contact details, Nathan at airsuit.com. I'd love to talk to you. We're also um, very active in terms of sharing knowledge um, and best practices that we learn along the way. We'll soon be releasing our 2020 State of AI report, which will focus on industry, research, geopolitics, and talent. You can find it at stateof.ai. And also we run a monthly industry analysis um, through newsletter.airsuit.com which will do much of the same, but on a more regular tempo. This year, we're really excited uh, to be sponsored by Darktrace, which as most of you know, is the world leading cyber AI company. They've been fantastic supporters of Rise for, for a long, long time. And if you wanna hear more about their company and their products and all the exciting stuff that they're doing, please reach out to info at darktrace.com. And for those of you who've been to Rise events before, you'll remember that Dave Palmer, who's Director of Technology at Darktrace, gave a fantastic talk about how their machine learning solution mimics an enterprise immune system, essentially learning how a company operates and using that learning to try and detect the abnormal. And so we're really excited to have Dave back actually on the live stream. He's been a fantastic supporter of RISE. So thank you again to Darktrace. And thanks to Cooley, who's been a longtime supporter for the event. And in particular, Aaron Archer, who's always there for helping finance and startups, uh, helping them with IP issues and m and uh, He's always open to talking to companies as early as possible. And you can reach him at AAArcher at Cooley.com. The firm's also exposed some fantastic startup documents that you can use to get your company off the ground. And you can find that at CooleyGo.com. So with that, I want to uh, welcome our amazing panel of 12 speakers that we'll have today spanning a couple time zones from London to California. You'll hear from people who work on semiconductors to robust machine learning methods and self-driving cars to biological systems and healthcare, and also the important topics of AI ethics and the law. As a primer, each talk will be 25 minutes and we'll have five minutes of Q&A, which we'll moderate through the chat. So please use the Zoom chat to post your questions as and when they come up. Include your name and affiliation so speakers have a bit more context over your background. And if you're active on Twitter, you can find us at RISE.org and hashtag RISE2020.